everyone, this is part two of my makeup tutorial for face only using Elf products. So in my past video, I did the base, um, basically starring on your makeup, and I just got finished adding the first trans transition lover color to my face. So now we're on to the next color, and the next dark color is well, I kind of skipped a couple. We go into this color. I don't think I never used it before. Um, and this palette is called Summer Breeze, I think it is. <laughs> I actually forgot what it's called. Um and the funny part is I it took me a couple months or a couple um weeks to buy all of this because I was using all my money. Like all my money, like my mom. Mom helped me buy some of it, but like most of it I bought by myself. Um, so yeah, so that's why it took me such a long time to make this video. Um, so yeah. Oh, sorry. I knew now I'm going into that color. It's towards the end, it's a color right next to black. Oh, and all of these colors for my crease is using the eyeshadow Seabrush. And the reason why it's called that is because it's like, it's shaped as a half C, like your crease is. So that's kind of like pretty understandable. So I go to Burt's or TJ Maxx, one of the two. I get this like makeup kit and it comes with like fake eyelashes, almost like a new kit. The brushes, but I tell you, they are rough. They are rough. Like they irritate my skin. Like they itch my skin. These are like soft. They feel like animal fur. See here? <laughs> it's the eyeshadow coming off. Uh, and I'm just gonna like, kind of blend it in, but it looks way much better in person than on camera. Like you can't really see it, but you can see that my white, my my white, my face is as white as I don't know what. And I'm just gonna blend it, but there's a blending brush, so I'm gonna use that. Um. So yeah, by men, I know it's kind of weird. We're going back with that same color that I've been using. And I'm going to apply it like right in that out outer corner. And I'm pretty sure you use the brush you've been using, the eyeshadow C brush. Like, I don't see why. And then I just bring it to the crease. And just to let y'all know, it is like 10 something at night that I'm doing this. <laughs> um, so I'm gonna say poo head. I don't know who else does that um, from 30 at night. Um, so now I'm kind of done with eyeshadow, for now at least. <laughs> and now I'm gonna put my blending brush if I can find it. Cause like, I made a cosmetic bag, which is this one, which is for sale, go on my Instagram page, which is I think Angel Sweetly, and yeah, this is sample, so like I would, it would take a couple weeks or a couple months, and that's where I keep all my elf makeup, so like I just empty it out on my bed, which wasn't that smart, because <laughs> now I can't find it, what I need. Kind of looks like your concealer brush, but it's not. And it is so smooth, it's ridiculous. And I'm just blending it in. 
I mean, I do, I don't mind this palette. Like, like, don't get me wrong, but it's not with the colors. Like, you kind of have to mix and match your own. Um, that's what I don't like. Okay, so I did that. You can't really see. I'm trying to, like, let y'all see. Um, but it's hard to see, you just kind of see, like, you kind of see when I need them. Okay, so I'm now about to wear Big Glasses More Liquid Eyeliner. The closest I can get to liquid eyeliner is pretty fine. It's my first bottle. Like, literally, <laughs> I just got this thing today, like, a couple hours ago. Like, I don't know, guys. No. I don't know. But... The color is coffee. This is like coffee. Okay. So, a lot of people might not understand. Excuse me. Cream eyeshadow. I mean, not eyeshadow. But they do have cream eyeshadow. But I don't have any. Cream liner. Eyeliner. It's basically. So, there's like three levels in eyeliner. There's the pencil. Which is like the best to start off with. And then there's the cream. Which is one step closer to the liquid eyeliner. So it's kind of liquidy. It's kind of like a liquid eyeliner. Except it's kind of like almost hard. That was actually a pair on my finger. <laughs> I smell my makeup. It doesn't really have a smell, but it, it's extremely easy to um, apply. And let me tell you something. This thing is like nice packaging. Oh, I think it's a glass. I don't know, but I think I got this thing. I got my eyelid primer for only $3. This for $2. $2. Who would thought? And just to let you know, L. Guess what it stands for? Eye, lips, face. Who would have thought? I just thought, like, they named it, just name it Elf. No. Eye, lips, face. It's abbreviation. I love that. Great job, Elf. <laughs> um, so I'm going to take my angle brush. I just need to find it. Like, I'm really good at finding it. This is a precision brush. This is a small angled brush. But like, this one kind of gets my stuff. An eyebrow dual brush. Yay! More than like the second one. This is just my brush. Like, don't get me wrong. I know how my brushes look, but kind of gets it. This is the brush that it comes with. I might actually use it. Um, I'm probably just going to I have for oh, now because I don't know. <laughs> um, I use, I'm going to use this one. I'm going to have another one in here. This is a bummer. Oh, well. Because, like, I got a super duper big one. And it's a really nice one. So, I'm basically going to take my nails. I'm just going to, like, go up and down. Now, <laughs> y'all might not be able to get good footage of me doing it. But you basically want to do it like you doing it. I went into cat line. And we got to try this for the first time. Oh my god. So, oh my god. Like, you can see it, but it's like really light. I don't know how to do it without like not doing this to your eyebrow. I mean, okay, it got a little messed up. I'm just trying to get it really nice looking. Oh wait, 
I can barely see. But like I'll post really good pictures on Instagram, so don't show her. Oh. Okay, I honestly do not care for frame. I like it. Like, I thought I would. I thought it would be, like, extremely soupy and, like, I don't know. So, I'm going to just pause it really quickly and see how it looks on my bigger mirror. So, I'll be like, I can touch all of it. Alright, so I kind of fixed it. This eye looks way better than this one, sadly. Um, I kind of, like, took, like, some makeup removal and kind of, like, took some off under my eye. And basically, since this one looks like I bright under my eye, that's what we're going to do. Um, it's just because I feel like this ankle brush is not good quality. Like, literally, I, I don't care for it, so I don't care for it. But there, I'm going to post really good pictures on Instagram, so don't worry. Like, I know this video is not going to look that good. I might actually even redo it, depending on how it turns out. I know, I'm, I'm looking like a raccoon here. And I'm sorry. I'm like, never done this. What? <laughs> don't get me wrong, I dealt with cream, but not in makeup. Oh no, not in makeup. <laughs> it's a mess. But it's actually, I mean, it looks decent. I just have to get used to this cream eyeliner. So I'm kind of done with. Wait, this one's not the best one. This one. <laughs> this makeup tutorial is so goofy. I am so very sorry, y'all. It's actually looking pretty well. So next, um, I'm just, no more of that. <laughs> okay. So, nail on to mascara. Alright. So, usually I'll just use the work that comes here. But, I'm going to see. <laughs> this is out. Everything is out. Except the makeup remover. <laughs> okay. So, I got this from Dick Cheek. All the brushes I did in some makeup. But most of it I didn't. And basically, what you do is you just take this brush out and you apply that. One, which is actually pretty good in case you want to have your friends over and you want to do your makeup or like you don't want to like like use it you can use this one or vice versa oh that's like way too much usually you get a lot and I feel like you have better control. Um, I like working with this one, but it's just usually I have to wait for it. I'm gonna do my under. So half of the stuff that I show you in this video, I do not do on a daily basis. Um, I don't put on foundation. Um, I do my cat line. I do my crease. I do eyeshadow. Um, but well, I never do my under lashes because if, like, my eyes, um, start irritating me, I, like, rub them underneath 
So no, that's not going to be good. I feel like it looks pretty decent from like a for a movie. <laughs> like I'm not a movie at makeup. I've been doing makeup for a while. These are myself. Um, it's not like I'm new to makeup. Like this is my first time me ever trying makeup. I do do advanced makeup. One person thought I was 16. No way, Jose. At the time, I think I was nine. Um, that's right. One year later, I think I might have been 10. Um, but I can't remember. But I do do very advanced makeup. Um, so yeah. So now that I have done that, I got highlighter. This highlighter does it's it doesn't like work that good. You have to mix other highlighters. But the other highlighter. Right. 